I need another big assist. But before we do that, uh, this is a safety thing for me. I can't come on without it because I mean, this is the ground. You see those little pieces of wood there? Can you come over to it? And can you just slide it? You see how it slid? I just need you to slide it under where it was. Yeah. You just slide it right underneath there. There you go. You go whoa, whoa, don't, don't rock me. Okay, good. That's fine. Now I'll try the other side. You could have sped right under there with a little notch. There you go. Thank you very much. That's right on fault. Thank you. That's fault. Okay, now, I need to fill these up, Dave. Because I fill these up, I need you to find someone in the stands who has a lighter we can borrow. Uh, check the kids from Winnipeg. Excuse me, sure. Someone have a lighter? We'll give it back to you. Yeah, yeah. Yes? Yeah? Okay, we'll get back to you. Thanks, Dave. Now, as I fill these up, it takes a moment, but it gives me a chance to say a couple things. Uh, the first one, so I'm very grateful to be here. Winterlude is an amazing event. I get to go all over the world to events, and this is by far my favorite winter carnival in the entire world. And uh, I want you to realize the reason you have such an amazing event here is because of you. Today, every single one of you made a conscious choice. Instead of sitting at home in front of a TV or a computer or a screen, you came out to a live event, you watched a live show, and you hung out with other real people. I think we need more of that these days. Give yourself a huge round of applause. The second thing, kids, what you're about to see is very real. There is no such thing as fake fire. Believe it or not, people actually ask me that sometimes. What I'm trying to say, kids, and I hope you clearly understand, is under no circumstances can you ever even think about trying to help. Man, school's a much better place for this kind of thing. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm a trained professional. If you stop and think about it, I have been performing this show for over 18 minutes. <laughs> Here you go, I have to throw this back to you, Dave. Awesome, this cat. Now, before I light these up, uh, I don't want to leave anyone out. Esquiliade, yeah. yeah, Fonta Pony, see you green? Yeah, bienvenue. Uh, bon chose. Je suis vraiment désolé que je parle pas français devant le spectacle. Et je viens de Los Angeles et je parle français comme un bâtard espagnol. Now, I joke around about a ton of stuff, the most being that I'm from the States. But it is true. When I moved to Canada a long time ago, I'm here by my choice, and I'm so proud to call Canada my home. I don't know if you know this, in the state, hockey is just a sport. But here in Canada, you know it's so much more than that. It's a culture, it's a community. And my favorite part is the inclusivity, because everybody deserves a chance to have a shift on the ice. So whether you're fans or not, I want to thank you for coming out today and sharing a little bit of your hockey culture with me. Thank you. Okay, dude. In a moment, hey, you're going to hear some music you really recognize.
Okay. So folks, I've been joking around a lot before I get serious. Uh, I've been juggling for over 25 years. And I juggle pretty much everything on the planet you can imagine. From fruits, to balls, to knives, to fire, even girlfriends. <laughs> this is by far the most difficult and dangerous thing I know how to juggle. Uh, the snow makes it so difficult for me because of the visual. It messes with my focus. I'm going to give it a test throw here. One more test throw. I'm going to give you my best. Now I tell you all this because even on a perfect day I do miss sometimes. If I miss, Dave, that's why you're here. I'm going to ask you to hand the sticks back to me, okay? So please wait for instruction safety first. Nothing distracts from the finale like a flaming volunteer. Right? Now, if I miss after twice, I gave you my very best. I still hope everyone had a great time with the game, yeah? yeah? Hey, if I do miss, most of you'll understand. You're true Canadians, true hockey fans, and you know, sometimes the flames can be disappointing. Yeah. I'm gonna beat the sticks together slowly like this. As I do that, I want a slow, rhythmic clap from everyone. When the time's right, I'll go for it. If I get it even for a moment or two, go nuts, scream, yell, holler, throw your baby's knee or whatever you got. Americans, whip out your gun, shoot them in the air like a Mexican wedding. I love Mexicans, I like that. I take my gloves off here, and give me my best. I kinda can't feel my fingers, my gloves got wet. <laughs> Sorry. 